Hello my friends, this is Tom, your host from WeaponsEducation.com, your pro Second Amendment right activist, and I'm right on top of everything that's happening in the background. In this video I want to talk about ammunition, the high demand for it. It's happened to us in the past. Now we're dealing with this COVID-19 issue, which is very real, and we're going to talk about the cost of ammo and how to accumulate it right now. In another video, I got to talk about how to get him and get handguns because they're hard to get. So I'll touch on some things. Let me get right into it. Let me get right into it. Uh, and as a, I'm a financial planner, I've mentioned this from day one of, of my channel nine, ten years ago. Okay, I'm the CEO of a large firm. That's what I do in my real life. And I've mentioned many times on the channel about ammunition on how to accumulate it the proper way as a financial advisor. First of all, if you get any handgun, whether it be a 9mm, I'll, I'll tell you about these handguns on the table in a moment. Let's say it's a 9mm, whatever it is, a Glock 19. When you buy the gun, obviously get enough rounds to go practice with it and get and get all the practice you need and the training you need, obviously. But ammunition is a commodity. It's like gold. It's like this watch I purchased 20 years ago is now worth four times what I paid for it. It's like something as silly as this gold chain I paid for when I was a kid. Uh, and now it's worth way, 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 way more than what I paid for it. So, ammunition is something you're really not going to lose money on. And you also need it, obviously, for self-defense. You need it to fire your gun. You need it to practice. So, I'm going to pretty much focus on self-defense ammo in this video. Because right now, in the times we're in, with everything going on and people out of work and I'm seeing a lot of stuff I'm not gonna cause some drama here um, you need some good self-defense ammo I always talk about double tap but we're gonna, we're gonna talk about this dollar cost averaging meaning ammunition right now if you go online to all the major online retailers it's gonna be mostly by bulk Okay, now I know that's pricey. So when you get a firearm, it's kind of like I'm here in South Florida. You get into boating, I tell you what, you're not just buying a boat. You're buying a $10,000 a year nut to pay for for the rest of your life as far as maintenance and gas and getting it cleaned and getting it stored. And when we buy a firearm, it's kind of similar. We got to have ammunition a lot of ammunition and we got to upkeep our firearm but with that said dollar cost averaging means simply this you buy as you get your weekly paycheck let's say you get paid weekly you buy one box a week see you have a financial planning firm and I tell all my clients to systematically buy whether the prices are high or low and over 10 years you'll be ahead of the game so with that said when we buy a firearm whether it be a car nine millimeter this happens to be an AK we're gonna talk about the guns on the table in a moment but you need to obviously have the ammunition to make these products function with that said what I would do because there's a lot of people who are low on funds right now, out of work, and I respect that. But if you're going to buy a new firearm, a lot of new firearm purchasers, and a lot of you already have your firearm and you have adequate amount of ammo. But what I would do is, first of all, if you buy a new firearm, get a thousand rounds with it. Through high demands in the past, and right now it's really, really high with the COVID-19 issue, which is extremely real and is going to last who knows how long. With that said, ammunition, if you go online, which I did prior to this video, is mostly being sold in bulk. 
Uh, I'm a double tap guy. I, I'm talking right now about mostly self-defense, self-defense ammo. When I, when I hoard up, I call it hoard up, for myself, when I want to have a lot of ammunition, I want to have it to be self-defense ammo, not range ammo, because this is what's going to go up in value. And I like to think when I spend money on a product, like, like this car, this, this special edition 9mm car for TIG from Benghazi, one out of a thousand made. Uh, I've got number 300 something out of a thousand made, only a low number. This is going up in value. So I like to think about the purchases I, I spend my money on. And when it comes to ammunition, right now the situation is, what, the way I see it, is they're selling in bulk. Now, you, I went to Double Tap's website, my favorite, because they make it all by hand, this, that, and the other, and it's super high-end, super high-pressure, um, self-defense ammo, so I have, I have so much Double Tap because I've been doing what's called dollar-cost averaging, and I know this goes up in value. I have ammo I paid $15, $20 a box for that is now $50 a box, okay? So, you want to systematically purchase ammunition you get a firearm whatever it is nine millimeter car nine millimeter glock 45 walther 45 sig and those guns are all hard to come by by the way that's a whole separate video guns right now are extremely hard to come by which makes me think well hmm is it american citizens buying them Yes, there's a lot of American citizens by the, let's say, hundreds of thousands buying them. But there could be a political party who's possibly purchasing them all so we can't have them. Possibly. So think about that. Things are changing rapidly. You need ammo is what I'm getting at. You need ammo with your gun. Your car's not going to run without gas. Your, your firearm's not going to fire without ammo. So, dollar cost averaging means exactly this. You buy it whether it's high or low, the price. When you get paid, you buy a box. And then do the math. If you buy 50 boxes a year, at the end of the year, well, you get 50 boxes of 50 rounds. And at the end of 10 years, you do the math, you've got a, a lot of ammo and you're gonna be way ahead of the game that way. And if you right now, if you have to buy by bulk, you're gonna to have to, before you buy, if you're a new gun owner, before you buy your first gun and say, all right, I'm gonna get a gun and one box of ammo, that's not gonna work because you gotta go shoot a thousand rounds right off the bat just to get trained and, get, and practice and, and, and get to be acclimated with your firearm. So, I know it's pricey, I know a lot of people are out of work, and I know things are difficult right now, so maybe this is not the exact time for you, but when it is, when, when you have the funds, get yourself X amount of rounds, a thousand rounds of whatever firearm you own, whether it's a 9mm, 40, 45, 10mm, my favorite round. I'm so glad I bought so many, so many of the, here. This is these are 50, 50 uh, AEs Action Express, and I'm I'm sporting this. I'll show you this. I've been carrying this snakeskin. Um, I, 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 the only way to carry it is is with an awesome one of my shoulder holsters. So I have to show it to you. But I love it. I love it. But you have to have a lot of ammo, and I'm so glad. I've been, I'll put the link below for the custom made, handmade shoulder holsters, my company. And I'm so glad I purchased so many systematically boxes of 50 AE. Otherwise, the gun would kind of be useless if I just had like two boxes of this. You see what I'm saying? I would be just like, all right, I got my gun. I really can't go to the range and practice with it because I'll be out of ammo. So, right now, tough times. I know what's going on with the gun world in, in the background. There's possibly, you know, a political party, I won't name, that does not like the Second Amendment that is buying everything. Okay? Possibly, right? 
possibly buying all the guns. Go try to buy a SIG 320. It came in a 357 SIG right now. I'm trying to find one. I'm trying to find one online. It's going to be difficult. So, these things are precious. These are commodities. Your ammunition, we're focusing on ammunition. Whether it be for an AK, this is an arsenal, AK-47. And I've been systematically, since I got the firearm, I'm thinking, well, i got to have enough ammunition for it. Weekly or monthly, buying ammunition for it so I have enough for whatever reason, maybe I want to do it for a profit. This is America. We all work for a profit, right? We all we all spend money for, for a reason. Let's make a profit. Well, I, I do it for two reasons. Hopefully make a profit and then obviously to have enough ammo to fuel the firearm. 9mm. You got to have enough ammo. A lot of people are saying buy off the wall, um, not off the wall, but you know, uh, not so popular calibers like a 32 or a 25 and things like that. Sure, as long as you got the gun. If you got the gun, load up, get thousands and thousands and tens of thousands of rounds of everything you can get because you're not going to lose money on ammunition. There's always going to be someone who's going to want to buy your ammunition. Just do everything legally. If you do it online, they're very strict. They won't do it legally. And that's my message today is they're selling in bulk. Everything I can see. Double Tap will sell individual boxes as of today, but that could change tomorrow. But most of their stuff is bulk also. But at least that's the best self-defense in my opinion. Everyone's got their own opinion. And then all the other stuff, all the good Winchester and Hornady's and all that stuff, they're pretty much selling in bulk. So maybe once every three months, get yourself a thousand rounds of whatever caliber you desire, but get it. You're not going to lose money on it. That's the key. This is a, a business also. This, I mean, I'm telling you as a businessman, you're not going to lose money on ammunition. It's just like buying a good watch. You can buy a Timex, yes, it'll keep time, but in 10 years, will it be worth four times its price? No. Or you can buy a watch that's made out of 18 karat gold and it's got a bunch of diamonds and at the time you can afford it. And then in 10 years from now, it's worth five times the price. Great. Ammunition's doing that. It's a commodity like gold. So I respect all of you and I'm just trying to tell you uh, things are changing. We don't know what's going to happen with the political situation, with the, who the next president's going to be, and if it changes to a liberal, a democratic president who does not want us, no secret, to own this stuff, this stuff is really going to skyrocket. And who knows? I don't even who knows what's going to happen. You want it, ammunition now. Get your ammunition now. Get your gun, get your ammunition. They're both in short supply. And don't worry to buy it now because the price is high. Like I said, it's dollar cost averaging. That's all I have to say for now. Thank you for everything, guys. And uh, I care about everybody. Thank you. Thumb up the video. Bye-bye.